Welcome or welcome back to my channel. Let's hop right in to this week's video. I'm starting off with these two 8x10 canvases that I picked up from Dollar Tree. I'm using my blue painter's tape to create my desired designs. I brought them outside to spray paint them with my metallic spray paint that I purchased from Home Depot and as I was spray painting I noticed that this spray paint was a little dull but luckily I had an extra can that was not defective. This is the new can and you can definitely see the difference. While my canvases are drying, I'm going to get started on these condiment bottles that I purchased from Dollar Tree as well. The lids are not needed and I'm using the measuring side as the back side and also a guide as to where to glue the ice rocks. Although these bottles are plastic, I had no issues with the glue burning the bottles. This is what I have so far, and I'm going to repeat the same exact steps for the other bottle. I'm using this adhesive diamond wrap to decorate and if you are going to recreate this then I suggest you add a little glue so these can last over time. I did not fill in the middle because that's where I'm going to glue my bottles. You should use a stronger adhesive if you plan on recreating these. I'm adding more ice rocks to cover up the top of the bottle. I continuously reuse these string lights that's why they're looking a little worn out but all I'm doing is stuffing the bottles with the string lights. I'm stuffing the bottles with these flowers that I have for some time now and these were purchased from Dollar Tree as well. I'm using some clear tape to secure the battery pack. These turned out very beautiful. They look very classy. They don't even look like Dollar Tree items, but comment below and let me know what y'all think. For this next project, I'm reusing this mirror that I purchased from the Dollar Tree and I'm just covering it before spray painting. I 
I use my silver metallic spray paint to cover this and to decorate, I'm using more of the diamond wrap. I'm using a combination of the ice rocks and also these acrylic gems to fully cover the bottle. I combined the acrylic gems with the ice rocks because I knew I wasn't going to have enough ice rocks left to complete the project. I'm cutting the top off so my battery pack can be able to fit inside. I'm adding this candle to my project and if you are going to recreate this, then please use a stronger adhesive so your projects can last over time. I'm using these gems that I purchased from Amazon and these will cover up the battery pack. If I didn't cut the top of the bottle off, the top of the battery pack wouldn't have been able to fit inside the bottle. This turned out amazing as well. Comment below which project was your favorite for this week.